Him. Hello and welcome to a brand new stream of Russian Fishing 4, guys. How's it going? Blast main, ET Gaming, GD. What's up, guys? Thank you. We're at six likes now. Thank you so much. Just going to refresh my stream here. It's already not... ...ing up. There we go. There we go. Okay. Uh, we're just gonna do, um, East Siberian Sturge today. I don't have too much time. Two hours, maybe. <clears throat> uh, but I'm gonna just do one hour. Let's see how active it is. 199 kilometers per hour. Guys, uh... Hold on to the bench, because we are going almost 200 kilometers per hour. I know it doesn't seem like it, but you best believe. There we go. Dark. Okay, here we go. Alright, where the heck are you guys? Hello? Everyone left. ADT. Ended up staying all night. Ooh. Yeah, you still have a few days until the new year, the weekend's here, so that'll be a better time to do it, I guess, because more people on the weekend. Uh, where are we? Uh, one thirty and one. There we go. And such a long clip. I feel like it'll be closer from the other shore. This is going to be a slow stream because, you know, we are going after Sturge. Little bite rate and whatnot. Uh, but lots of garbage fish too. Lots of non markers and tiny burbs and stuff. So let's see what we get today. Thank you. Yes, I am. Uh, it's, it's not bad, you know. I'm just happy they're active and they're biting. So maybe today's the day we get a big one. Yeah. Thank you for posting active spots and trophies and details on our Discord, guys. Thank you for your support. I really appreciate it. Uh, so for this stream, I'm only going to do sturgeon fishing for maybe one hour if it's really good for two hours. You know, tomorrow and day after is our main streaming day. So I'm hoping, you know, we can get a four hour streams, perhaps a uh, hundred percent. Sneak peek for tomorrow. I am going to go to Yama and I am going to do float fishing for you guys. All right. I might end up swearing on stream. I might end up bashing my head on my keyboard. I might end up just turning off my stream all of a sudden because it's float fishing and I absolutely hate it. But I'm going to do it. Okay. I'm going to try for you guys. Um, I do have a Bolognese 14 kg rod. Uh, I have 17 kg line, 13.8 kg liter. Uh, I think it's a size 6 hook people are using and not a size 1. And grasshopper 
is what I'm going to use. I don't have bait, obviously. I don't have sandwich. That's like the PVA of float. My float scale is very little. 53.2%. I'm shocked that I'm even at 53% to begin with. Uh, but yeah, that's what I'm going to try tomorrow. And then we might go to the sea. The issue is at the sea, nothing's working. It's only 34, 41 meter holes, you know, with tiny fish. Good money. But like... That's not why I'm going to go there. I want big fish. So let's see how tomorrow goes. Maybe someone will post a spot. I know store fisk works, but even with store fisk lure, it's not that great. Otter on the hunt. Hi. Welcome to the stream. How's it going? So, yeah, 99% of the stream, guys, we're just going to be standing around doing nothing. 1% of the time, it's going to be us full locking a sturge if there is a sturge big enough. And then there is a tiny possibility we might hook into a big one. Now, the issue is all of my reels are busted. 22% friction break. Mech is at 9%, which is okay, I guess. 13.7% friction break damage. 20% mech damage. That is not good. And then our goal off. 13% uh, friction break damage. Mech is 25%. We're not looking too hot. Um, I think I have enough money to repair all three reels. But I don't know when I'm going to do that, though. You know, I've seriously wanted to... Seriously, seriously wanted to... Uh, stream City Skylines. I so badly want to play more of that game before... You know, my work starts and I won't have time. But every time I stream that game this week, people are like, Oh, when RF4? Are you streaming RF4? When RF4? And I'm like, guys, have a little variety in your life. There's more things in life than RF4. <laughs> oh, man, people. Your furnace? That ain't good. Yeah, it is finally going to cool down tonight. It's not too cold, but this amazing warm weather we've been having is going to come to an end. It will cool down, but not really much. Like, every day we're looking at around freezing. So that's, what, 32 degree Fahrenheit? We're going to go 30 degree Fahrenheit, 32 degree Fahrenheit highs. And the lows are, a like, a little bit, you know, a little bit lower than that. So I hope your maintenance guy comes early, though. Or soon. Yeah, Jan and Feb is when winter comes with a vengeance. Whenever we have a late start to the winter. And something nibbled and like it made my lure go all the way there. My bait. Stupid fish. I'll leave it there for now. <laughs> for fun. Hi, welcome. What up, what up? How's it going?
Good, good. I'm doing good. How about you? Man, I kind of want to recast this. Okay, that one's screwed. <laughs> Obviously, they're going to give the crappiest no-name games for free. It's all right. You, uh, if we do, I mean, get good fishing, you will see the highlights. So <clears throat> thank you for, even if you just log in to say hi, I appreciate it. Thank you for that. Anyone else fishing? I mean, if we get two more people, we can do a competition. Come on, this was, this is really active yesterday. What's going on? Uh, now that I'm streaming, y'all are, y'all are quiet here. Uh, a little bit of rain. I mean, temperature is a little warm, but that's fine. There we go. Tiny fish. And a more first fish and almost two kg or more. I'm happy with that. That's gonna be some money. So night time, I think we're gonna start getting a lot of fish. Not a lot, but like burbots, amours, maybe. Gonna have to keep an eye on that. <laughs> Lead Enforcer, welcome. How's it going?
Mirax, hi, welcome, long time. How are you guys doing? Hey, what are you fishing for, Red Tongue? Hi, hello, welcome. Ah, uh, you're fishing right now for Tugan, but it's very bad buy rate. Hmm. Uh, do I know any rates, uh, spots, or telescopic? N I don't. Telescopic is float fishing, correct? Because I hate float fishing, so <laughs> I'm not. I don't know. Uh, but um, uh, at Yama, there's a float fishing spot, so Vidivi, hi, welcome. What up? What up? On Sturgeypool. Oh, you don't have level 32. I have no idea where else to float fish. Uh, you can try VK or Discord, the official channel, but I don't... I don't pay attention to float fishing, so I, I can't tell you. Another tiny fish. Oh, that's a sturgeon, not a sterlet. Damn it. Alright, I'm gonna chop it up. Oh, you're one KD line. Yeah, that is scary. That's a very small setup. They're very poor. Good time. 
All right, this rod's getting something. I'm happy for that because <clears throat> the bait was uh, pushed further away from our target area. Something tiny on it. Something very tiny. What the heck? Wasting my PV and gold bait. What the hell is this? 266 gram burbot. Blood hook. Guys, I will be streaming with Gustav tomorrow on Twitch, so please join my Twitch. Uh, I have pinned the message, the link, so. You know, trolling spots or spin spots where I could just fish. I do not. Uh, Volkov seems to be active, but like, you're telling me Corona and Super Duty, I don't know what that is. Like 5kg, 15kg setup? I mean, you can try Cory. I think Volkov is too much for you. With those, with like a what, 10kg setup, 15kg setup? You need at least like 15 caliber setup if you're gonna go to Volkov. Thirty four KG setup. Thank you, thank you. Got it dead. Uh so you can go Volkov. Not gonna be too good though, like three hundred silver if it's really good. Uh someone posted a spot on VK. Archipelago seems dead. There's no point going there. Uh Volkov is the only trolling map I know of right now where you might get a chance see yeah, I told you guys night time is trash fish time Brim hi Arc is active. Um, There we go. Doesn't seem too big. 
18 to 20 kg is my guess right now. Because I can lift my rod <clears throat> and drop it and the resistance isn't going to orange or red. So, you know, I'm being super aggressive and not snapping my line. There is a possibility it could just bash its head while, oh, like that, see? It got super angry right there. meter clip is brutal. I love it when it's like a 45 meter clip. 60 is too much. Someone also commented on my active spot video for this spot. And they said, oh, if you're going to walk, don't walk upstream, walk downstream with the current. And I've never done that. Is that what, is that the right way? Oh, damn. That, uh, oof, that really jumped. Like, I walk against the current. I don't walk with the current. Because it's still fighting. Okay, let's walk a little bit more. Doesn't matter if I'm going to drink coffee because my energy's still going to drop. There we go. No. Twenty-eight AGE Siberian. Yes, that felt uh, a lot smaller. That felt a lot smaller. Really good work there. No PVA on this bad boy too. Uh, Sixty meter clip. In case you haven't watched the active spot video. There we go. <sighs> now we just need something, you know, like a hundred kg. Uh, Grim, could you post eats on that spot in case Merax wants to go there or anyone else? Uh, you wish the fish had a little more realistic movements to just actually crash and jump in real life to shake hook. I mean, there's only so much realism they could do and you've seen the quality of the devs in this game. So just, you know, for the fish to even have animation and not look like rocks. It's pretty, it's a miracle, really. <laughs> so. Damn, 7 to 800 silver per hour at Archipelago. I have not seen that post. It's probably on the official Discord, perhaps. And I don't think everyone's going to get that. I think someone just got lucky with that 7 to 800. Because if it was really that active, I would be seeing all, like, so many people post that spot on VK. Four nets. Okay. Damn it. Tiny fish. Oh, you're fighting fish? Okay, no problem. Whenever you have time. 
when it's small, you always want it to be a sterlet because that's obviously the most expensive fish besides the Amur. All right, we have 128 kg, so I am happy. 17 minutes, one nice fish. I'm happy. Okay. Simplicity high, welcome. Made 2500 silver in three and a half hours. With the big Opa. Uh, only with the store fisk, right? Because I know, I think I saw that post on VK. Someone got a huge trophy Opa. But it's a stupid store fisk. 20 kg. Homefish yellow. Okay, okay. And where were you? 34 meter hole, 41 meter hole. Beats. Five meter, okay. Maybe if I just that at the fifty-five, I would get something cool as well, like an Opa or a Greenland or something. But I mean, three and a half hours is a lot. That's good money too. For almost four hours. Need 4k for ultralight.
Oh, my PB. I finished on that rod. Dang it. I need to remember to uh, put new PBA if I have any. Craft ground bites. Wow, I don't have sturge. Oh man, I need dried krill. Angelo, hi, welcome. What up? I'd have something on the first one. YT, hi, welcome. Uh, fishing is okay. I mean, it's sturgeon fishing. We've been here 20, about half hour. Uh, we got a 28 kg sturge, so I'm happy with that. Not too bad. All right, hopefully one of these from the two uh, is a sturge. Damn it. Okay, this is not a sturge. <laughs> Hopefully the other rod is a sturge. I mean, they want you to spend IRL money buying their gold baits. And they've specifically made it that Sturge will bite on gold baits. Different types. Uh, you can use Nightcrawler. They will bite on that, but it's very rare. So...
Hey. No. <laughs> the way the rod was bent felt like it was uh it was a sturge, but could be a very small sturge. I just hope it's a sterlet. Baby sturge. Went four. There we go. All right, this feels small. Being a little reckless here. Uh, this could be like 12 kg. What do you guys think? I hope it's bigger. I hope it's 18 kg. I hope I'm underestimating here. Yeah, this does feel like a 12 kg. It's... Oh, we're getting something else there. That's good. And 16 meters takes forever. Twenty three kg. Hey, I'm happy with that. I thought it was ten kg smaller than this. Yes, sir. I'm happy. All right. Uh, this is third rod. No, this is first rod. Bienu, hi, welcome, how are you? Blue tag burbot, uh, no. <laughs> um, even if it was a trophy or a blue tag burbot, it would be a lot more violent. I would see a lot of shakes and stuff. And it wouldn't just be as smooth as that. So, yeah, I'm happy. 28 kg, 23 kg in a little over half hour. Pretty good. Uh, welcome. It's good to see so many of you uh, tuning in today. Uh, I will be streaming on Twitch tomorrow uh, with Gustav. And then later on I will be doing the usual RF4 stream. Both Saturday and Sunday as usual. I uh, decent on the whole event. Now doing some parts of my new account. Cool, cool. For those of you who have finished the the event, did you guys get a manja or any other good reels? Fisher presence OP. What do you mean? Uh, Deep Rock Galactic. 
that'll be a lot of fun. It is a very multiplayer game. It's high action shooting and mining and stuff. And it has insane amount of good reviews on Steam. Uh, so I thought, you know, do something different. It should be fun. Lethal Company. Um, I don't want anything. Oh, this one. I just don't like the graphics. It's terrible. And, you know, I've, I've watched a few minutes of different streamers play this game and it looks extremely boring. Like, they're just running around and picking up things and that's pretty much it. You have 45 days of premium and 150 kg key. What? You have 45 days of premium and 150. In what? In Fisher Online? What game are you talking about? Uh, Fishing Planet? What Fisher? Fisher Online? I lo- What? You log in and you get a present. Oh, the Christmas tree. You got to get those presents. You give it to the Christmas tree or something. And then you get a gift. Oh, that stuff. Damn. The RF4 <clears throat> devs are way too uh, stingy and, and cheap. They don't have a heart. Very small hearts. Uh, Fisher Online. See, like those are proper, proper presents. Like, those are worth, you know, spending your time on. Because those gifts motivate you. Whereas RF4, you're just going to get, like, what, five pieces of honey? A bait no one uses? <laughs> oh, man. I hate these small fish. There's just too much trash fish at this spot. Please hit that like button. Please subscribe, guys. Really need your support here. Is that a Sterlet? Yeah! 2KD Sterlet. There, let's go. Good stuff, good stuff. Takes 30 minutes to get a gift online doing your dailies. Man, I should log in and do it. <laughs> uh, survival train. I see. Hey, Nikita, thank you so much for subscribing. You are awesome. Uh, YT, the reason the devs have put things completely and extremely overpriced is because it actually works. Uh, there are a lot of whales that play this game. You know, a lot of Chinese, Chinese players... A lot of Russians uh, who are willing to spend hundreds and hundreds of dollars on this game, which is why they have priced it that way. If no one bought it, if no one bought anything at the price we have currently in RF4, they would eventually drop those prices. I mean, they're not stupid, right? Like, 
they made this game to make money, obviously, not because they actually like the game. Uh, it's to make money. And obviously, they know the metrics, they see it, they know the stats and everything, and they're priced it accordingly. It's really hard for us to say, hey, you know, if you do it, if you make this game cheaper, these items, you're, you'll have more sales. I think that's very hard to say because we don't know how much they're selling. We don't know, you know if they're making $100,000 a month or $50,000 a month or whatever they're making. So for normal people like you and I, yeah, if things were, you know, 60 bucks, maybe we would have spent money. Maybe more people would have spent money. But then you would need 10 people to buy Avenger in the new price versus just one person buying a $300 Avenger, which amounts to, let's say, you know, four buys. So not that simple. Got another grift. Yeah. Another 15 days spam. Damn. That's amazing. Yo, that's far better than our fours event. That's crazy. You missed everything. We caught Sturge. We caught fish. We talked about stuff. Noon time, but we're doing good, doing good, guys. <laughs> hey, you give them attention, all right? I don't know. All of the gifts are very small. Most are like baits. Some are like, you know, I don't know, fluorocarbon lines, leaders, reels, float setups, small ones, and then the rare ones. I think the last gift box has the best, has the best gift. <clears throat> possibility where you, where you can get those Borelica and Endgame reels, but obviously almost a 0% chance. Uh, this is the Golov. And no, it is not better than the Avenger. Golov is terrible. It wears like butter. And uh, if you have a big fish on, it will not reel in. It will be extremely slow compared to the Avenger. The only side for this reel is that uh, you can fit a lot of line on it which is completely worthless because you will never use this much line on any map outside of the sea 
And if you do have a fish where you require one kilometer of line, you are already screwed and doing it wrong. Alright, small sturge. I think this needs to be 12 kg. Alright, every sturge that I've guessed has been bigger than I thought. Because sometimes when I catch these sturge, they're much smaller than I think. Twelve kg. Twenty kg. What the heck? I love this. Yes. Oh man. They're no match today for us. Oh come on. I need Yeah, extremely grindy game. Yep. It's because it's free to play, right? And same thing with Fishing Planet. It's free to play and it's extremely... Extremely grindy. Please be a sturge. Please be a big fish. Please don't be trash fish. Thing is interested. Is it gonna take it? No, it is a tiny little fish. Uh, why T Fisher Online is pretty darn good. Damn it. Why couldn't you be a starlet, huh? Oh, we're getting something here. Oh. Okay, this guy's small. Like very small. Oh, that's my last PVA. Oh. All right. What are you? Twelve kg. Gonna be a twelve kg. Seven kg. Okay, it's much smaller. All right. Let's put uh, PVA on. Uh, 15 pieces. This is three pieces. I need to get rid of these. Yeah, so at this spot, you're going to get a lot of trash fish, but you're also going to get dirge, and uh, I'm happy with that. How's life been? Life's okay. It's going, you know, but what can I say? <laughs> you build yourself a really nice PC. Very nice. Very nice. I want to build a new PC, but the video cards are just trash. I don't know when I'm going to build it next.
Red Horizon with Boxing Day sale. The price wasn't cheap. I was looking here in Canada for any deals and there were no deals. It was just garbage. Cost you twenty two hundred. That's uh, a lot of money. Almost one hour, and I think we made uh, decent money today. I think twenty eight kg was our biggest fish so far. You know, it was better if I didn't get a fish on this, <laughs> if it was going to be this small. Alright, just a few more minutes. Eight minutes. Red, hello, hello, please, no spam. Uh, reef 30k, what's reef 30k? Is that a conventional reel? Uh, cause compared to conventional reels, it's terrible. All spinning reels at the sea are terrible compared to conventional reels. 
Because as soon as you get a cusk, as soon as you get a decent sized cod, it's going to take you forever to bring it in. Uh, which is why I went uh, conventional reel as soon as I could. A little bit longer. No, I don't have premium. Yes, I have not bothered with the challenges at all. <laughs> no, sir. Don't care. Why? Why should I go do the first one? What kind of command is this, bro? I'll do whatever the heck I want.
I, I, yeah, I just, I don't care about premium. Like, all I need is the happy hour at the sea so I can level up, but, like, I, I've barely spent time at the sea as well. It's just tomorrow... I'm gonna go to Yama first, probably. Maybe Sunday I might go to the sea. So, not sure. Ah, <sighs> yep. What time is it? Oh, in one hour. All right, let's go ahead, spawn back. I love her fish. How much we made? I think we did good. See, I would care if I was logging into the game every day. And I'm not. And if I do log into the game, it's to make an active spa video and that's it. So I, I don't care. <laughs> like right now I had uh, the happy hour active, but it was of no use because I'm maxed out at bottom fishing. So the only time I really need premium is when I go to the sea. And then on weekdays, I don't log in because obviously I'm at work. So just doesn't make sense. Even though this week I had time, I had a lot of time, but I played other games that I wanted to play and not waste my time with this. Yama float is very active. That's where I'm going to fish tomorrow. That's where the stream is going to be. I've already prepared this beauty. Look at this. Look at this. We have our Calibro here. 13 kg leader, 6 size hook, and grasshopper. So tomorrow uh, is stream Ayama with float if the temperatures are good, which I hope they are. Uh, but I feel like pretty soon I'm going to get I only have one setup. The others are too small. I'm sure I'm going to get sick and tired of this and I'm just going to go back to spend fishing the rest of the stream. I have this Bolognese. I have 3.8 kg. Spinning rod, Bolognese, 3.8 kg. 5.5 kg. 7.4 kg? I think that's still too weak. Oh, that's not even, uh, that's not even the one we need. But yeah, I only have one. My other ones are too small. There's no point. This walrus 7.4 is the only other one. <laughs> but whatevs, I'll see tomorrow. I'll do it for five minutes, then I'll get tired and I'll resort to spin fishing. Uh, that sucks. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. All right. One hour of uh, sturge fishing. It was very good today. Lots of trash fish, which is the normal. But we did get a decent amount of sturgy boys. 480 silver in one hour. 28 kg was our biggest one. 23, 20. Uh, basically these three, and that's it. 92, 106, 130 silver. Uh, Amour, Sterlet, all Amours and Sterlets, and a whole lot of Orbits. Orbit. That's it. So it's a decent spot. You're going to get Sturge per hour. Uh, what are your chances of catching a big one? No idea. Come check it out. Like, subscribe, comment. Let me see what's the biggest Sturgy boys here. Damn. I should have put the beetle larva too. Look at this. Other region. 80, 212. So this is super active.
So, pretty cool. Uh, you think spin fishing is working here? Small river. My guy, get off you. St oh, it's night time. I haven't done spin fishing here in forever. Back in the day before the sea, this was like my favorite place to just relax. You know, it's nice scenery. Nice river sound. And fish. Now yeah, you're at amber. Yeah, I don't know any spots with spinning. <laughs> That's why I'm here trying it out. Back in the day, like a year over a year ago, um, I would just come to the small river fish anywhere really here by the campsite. Usually you have a chance per hour and when it's very active up to 700. Uh, I'm using a speed of 21. Uh, if you have a popper. If you have a popper 4006, you want to use full speed plus shift. And do pauses. Delay is also working with spinning. Nice. Yeah, because of the event, uh, a lot of people are going to Belea for to do spin fishing. So, yeah, I don't. Um, at nighttime here, you're not really gonna get fish. Usually in the morning to early afternoon is when you start getting fish. Yeah, it's nighttime, nothing's nothing's happening, so I'm just gonna call it a day. So that was it guys, one short stream on a Friday. I'm gonna play City Skyline guys, so I'm gonna end it here. There's nothing really going on in our four. Uh so tomorrow guys, please keep in mind, I will be streaming on Twitch. I will do at everyone on our Discord. If you haven't already, please join the Twitch channel. Uh, it is pinned. Uh, and then later tomorrow, I will stream Russian Fishing 4. And I will hopefully see you all there as well. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I'll see you tomorrow. Agur